Hey, what's going on, everybody? Derp Furdler here. Welcome to the video. I hope you're doing well today. It's lovely to see you. Um, I'm kind of... I'm kind of... I don't want to say I'm getting burnt out on doing YouTube requests, but, like, I want to get back into just doing songs of my choice for a while, so that's what I'm going to do here. Uh, I picked a song today. It's a heckin' earworm. It's going to be stuck in your head the rest of the day, so you're welcome in advance. Uh, I'm talking about Don't Listen to the Radio by The Vines. Uh, this song is one of the catchiest songs I've ever heard in my life. Like, I, I sing it to myself <laughs> pretty often, like, whenever it whenever it uh, comes to mind. Uh, this song was featured in Flat Out 2, which was a game I played a lot when I was a kid as well, so I have, like, that nostalgia attached to it also. But uh, it's a good song. It's a good song, and I found a good, uh, I found a good Rocksmith chart for it. So we're going to play through it, and we'll uh, we'll talk a little bit more about it after this. So thank you for watching. Let's go. Don't listen to the radio by the vines. Flawless performance. And there you go. That was Don't Listen to the Radio by the Vines. I was not expecting to get 100% on that, but here we are. That's pretty cool. <laughs> That's pretty cool, not going to lie. 100% in Rocksmith are hard to come by, so I'm pretty proud of that. Uh, but yeah, that song is uh, that's a short one. It's a little over two minutes long. It's really catchy, though. It's really, really fun. Uh, the Vines typically have some really like fun, catchy music like this. Just fun to strum the power chords along to and stuff. And the solo was really, really easy. It was just like the main hook of the song or whatever. So this one's very approachable, I think, for beginners. If you're like just learning guitar and you want to get used to just like switching power chords around and stuff like that and uh it has a really really easy solo that sounds awesome and yeah it's worth checking out it's worth checking out everybody don't listen to the radio by the vines um anyway thank you for watching hope you enjoyed it uh make sure to like and subscribe leave a comment if you feel like it um yeah i think i think for a while i'm just gonna do my own thing with or maybe i'll just permanently pick my own songs for for youtube i prefer doing that because then i feel like because i do enough requests over on twitch 
<laughs> like I want maybe YouTube should be like my free form do whatever I want type of thing. I need to do more of whatever I want in general. I've been starting to last night as of when I recorded this, I did I did a Rocksmith stream where I didn't do requests. I just played whatever I felt like and talked to the chat and stuff and it was really fun. It was really fun. People still showed up and, and talked to me, so it wasn't a total failure. Uh, <laughs> anyway, speaking of the Twitch channel, twitch.tv slash dirtfurdler. Make sure you follow that if you want to ever catch me live. I do a lot of request streams. Uh, I play a lot of Rocksmith and Clone Hero uh, and whatnot, so make sure you stop by over there if you ever feel like it and subscribe if you want to support the stream. Um, follow me on TikTok. Follow me on Twitter. Sub to this YouTube channel if you haven't yet. If this is your first video you're seeing from me, uh, I think that's it. Join our Discord server as well. We're all over there chilling, having a good time. Uh, so yeah, that was Don't Listen to the Radio by the Vines. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Until next time, be good to yourselves, be good to each other. I love y'all a freaking bunch, and hope we can see each other again soon. Have a wonderful, have a wonderful day, everybody. <laughs>